So how are the current shutdowns and the uh, health environment uh, affecting vehicle titling and the processing of DMV paperwork uh, nationwide because of the coronavirus? So different states have different rules as far as public gatherings and uh, other shutdowns. But for the most part, as of right now, which is the middle of March, most DMVs and almost every state are open for business. And here's an article from one newspaper talking about the New York DMV, uh, that they're open, but they're only going by appointments only. You can't just walk in the door. Uh, that means they're still processing things, but they're appointments only. And one of the things we're recommending right now is to do your business with the DMV by mail. Don't go in person, first of all, to protect your own health and that of the employees, but also you may get faster service because items that come into the mail typically go to the main office of the DMV. It's their headquarter office. It doesn't go to a branch. If you walk into a branch, in many cases, they have to forward it to the headquarters, and that might even take longer than just getting there by mail. So we're rec recommending using the mail, using uh, remote forms. Now, remember, DMV does not do fax or email forms or verbal over the phone. You have to send them paper documents, but use the postal mail to do that. So that's an example in New York. Um, you know, in California, there was a, and, and this may change, and there, here's one of the things you may see, um, an article in the Sacramento Bee talking about the California DMV, and that this particular um, writer is talking about how large gatherings are banned, but why are the DMV offices open? And I can tell you, this article had a different headline. Even a few hours earlier, it said DMV is open. Now it's asking, why are they open, right? And the uh, interview with this one particular visitor says, I feel unsafe visiting the DMV, right? So you may see that there may be some pushback and there might be some uh, changes to the rules. And this is another reason why they might happen. Here's in Colorado, an employee at the DMV tested positive. So these are reasons why title processing might be uh, affected uh, in the near future. So what we recommend is getting your paperwork in as soon as you can. Don't wait around because right now, there's employees that can process it. The DMVs are open. If you wait a couple of weeks or even longer, there may be um, absentee uh, factors at the different DMV offices. There may be closures to the branches. Um, even if you mail it in, if half the people aren't showing up for work, either because they're sick or they're in quarantine or because they just don't feel comfortable going to work, that might slow down your title paperwork. So we recommend getting it in as soon as possible, no delay. Um, so that way it doesn't get slowed down in any bureaucracy or um, kind of health quarantines for DMV workers. So you may see some of this change, but as of right now, DMVs are operating as normal. We track it uh, every week, the different DMVs, how they're processing. And right now the turnaround times seem very, very normal. Um, getting to the DMV and getting in line in some cases a little bit longer, but typically we don't deal with that because we send them in with couriers or um, through the mail, uh, FedEx or um, through priority mail to get it there quicker. If you have any type of potential title paperwork application um, that you know you're going to do in the near future, we highly recommend getting it done and getting it sent in. Our website has all the forms, all the documents. You don't have to go wait in line to get the forms. You don't have to go wait in line to get information or instructions on how to do it. We have videos like this one that will give you all the instructions. And, you know, we'll do a video about this next week. But, you know, 90-something percent of all the visitors that contact us, call us, visit our website, they can do everything for free. 90-something percent of the people who reach us don't have to pay us anything, right? We're a free consumer resource for that reason. All the forms are there, video instructions, checklists. You can do most title paperwork yourself. In fact, you can do almost everything yourself that's legal to do. And the only reason why you'd need to pay somebody is just out of convenience or to make sure it got done right. So if you have title paperwork that is pending, or that you know you're going to need to do, we highly recommend getting it done quickly. Download the forms from our site, print them out, fill them in, get them to the DMV, get that process started so you don't get slowed down if and when some of these other health issues affect the absentee staffing of the DMV and they have to slow down paperwork or slow down registrations. And instead of taking a week or two, it might take a month or two to get your paperwork back from the DMV.